What's good, Red Gang, and welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name is Des, and today we are going to get into an Amazon haul. Not just any Amazon haul, okay? This is going to be probably one of the best Amazon hauls you've watched in a while, if I do say so myself. <laughs> no, I know I'm biased, clearly, but I actually, guys, this is my first Amazon haul on this channel. If you know anything about me, you know that at least one to five Amazon packages shows up at my doorstep every single week, okay? I am addicted to Amazon. I have tried the good, the bad, the ugly. I've tried it all. Um, and my Amazon storefront is one of the most beautiful storefronts you might have ever laid eyes on, okay? It's very well-rounded. I have everything on there from travel stuff, beauty stuff, um, you know, tech, influencer life, PA life, whatever your heart desires, it's probably there, okay? So if you're interested in finding out things I've been learning from Amazon recently, just keep on watching. So if you're not new here, then you may have stumbled across my Amazon storefront down in the description box of any of my videos here on YouTube. It's always linked there, okay? It's very well-rounded, like I already mentioned, tons of stuff that you can browse through, tons of ideas if you were just curious and seeing what the girls are picking up, it's there, okay? So what I did is I kind of sectioned everything up into different categories, and I'm gonna mention about somewhere between four or five um, things within each category. Try to keep it as concise as possible because these hauls can get out of control very quickly because of the amount of things that we all buy from Amazon. It's kind of embarrassing, Jeff Bezos. <sighs> we need to have a discussion. We are going to start off with the fashion category of Amazon. And I am going to start off with a bang, and it is these woven tote bags. Are you guys catching the vibe? What's a giving? It's giving a designer that rhymes with Rotega Donetta. These are some of my favorite Amazon fashion purchases, y'all. These bags, <laughs> they've been worn out. They're screaming. They're asking, they're crying for help to pick somebody else. And I'm ignoring them because I'm going to pick them every time. Can we get into the detail on the bag? The durability, the accessibility. <laughs> it's such a nice bag and it's so chic and it's so sturdy and it pairs so beautifully with so many different things. If you've been keeping up with me, then you know I took the black one with me to my London trip. I will leave a card on the screen if you're interested in that vlog. Um, but when I posted about it on TikTok, the girls were like, what's going on? Where's the bag? Where's the bag? Where's the front? Where's the front? Where's the front? And so, you know, I had to share because I will never gatekeep. I'm not a gatekeeper. I gotta put the girlies on. I got so much wear out of this bag in London. When I tell you it fit everything, my tripod, my phone, my wallet, my umbrella, everything in this bag. And honestly, because it's so comfortable, I didn't feel like uncomfortable. I didn't feel like my shoulder hurt, nothing like that. So I got back to the States and was like, I need the brown for the summertime. <laughs> for the spring and the summer, I need the brown. I need the camel brown. And it got it. Both of them. Gems, okay? It'll be linked down below. While we are on the topic of finding pieces that kind of can dupe for Rotega Donetta, I stumbled across these gorgeous bulbous earrings that are like the Bottega ones and they look like this and they are gorgeous and they are close they are the closest to the actual thing that I've seen anywhere on the internet so I will try them on for you guys so you guys can see what it's giving me personally for fashion jewelry like this I'm just not gonna pay a crazy crazy amount like for example these Chanel earrings I think were a little over 400 okay cool but like the Bottega price for these, I can't remember what they are, but I just know that they're outlandish and I was just like, I'm okay. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay. So I picked up these ones from Amazon. I mean, what? 
so good. Too good. Too good. They're stunning. They're gorgeous. So these are my latest obsession. They actually just got to me like a few days ago. And I'm obsessed. Cop yourself some Bottega Veneta. Doops. <laughs> As the girlies on TikTok would say. Do. Okay, next we are going to move on to the infamous BBL jacket. Okay, I don't know what it is, but these make every single person's body look immaculate, okay? These are the infamous BBL jacket. As you can see on the cutaway, it just hugs the body nicely, sucks you in, and it's perfect for running errands or to actually work out in. I've worn it for both. I have this in a black pair as well. I cannot find it right now, but I do own this in black, white. And even though this is a little different because it's sleeveless it still gives the same silhouette the scuba scuba diving but fashion you gotta you gotta go save the turtles at four but you got the runway at five if you will i really like this one too same concept but sleeveless they hug the body nicely make the girls sit up right i got a size small in all of these because they just fit my body like it's like my perfect size i like this style of a jacket to be like form-fitting tight to my body so i got it in a small okay so last piece of clothing and then i want to get into two things fashion wise that you need and you'll see what i mean when i get into it so i came across and i don't know how <laughs> this rat and boa inspired cover up it's so cute and it's just perfect it's perfect for the spring and the summertime especially if you're going on vacation just stunning just stunning and honestly i do not have the rat and bow one but it gives the same type of vibe is what i mean i don't think that the texture is exactly the same i don't think that the material is exactly the same but it gives the same vibe from a look perspective you know like how it physically looks on the body so i really love it i like the the string detail it adds a little bit a bit of an extra flair more than just like a standard cover-up that you can buy um i love the fact that the sleeves are super long and they drape over your hands it's just very elegant it's perfect it's going to look so nice on my body in jamaica okay <laughs> okay so these are the two fashion items that i'm going to they're 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 not clothing pieces or jewelry or accessories, but they're things that you really need to keep with you, especially on the go. The first one, I stumbled across this on TikTok and I'm so happy that I did. This is the Gentle Roll-On It Stays Body Adhesive. It washes off with water. So basically, you can use this anywhere that you want your clothes to stay. All you have to do is simply roll it onto your skin and then press your clothing in place. And baby, when I say, it's stuck it's up and stuck like literally stuck love it it looks like this it says it stays may be used by men women and children to hold any article in place against your skin it stays as pliable and moves with your body it stays washes off easily with water leaving no stain uses socks knee socks support hose nylons pantyhose shoulder straps wigs toupees theatrical makeup and devices orthopedic and surgical devices etc to use simply roll into skin and press article in place that's crazy let me find out y'all securing y'all's wigs with this stuff i'm not even gonna judge you because it's good <laughs> last item in the fashion sector is this steamer now i know steamers have been around for a minute i know y'all got y'all's little handheld ones whatever the thing that makes this steamer so much better than the rest in my opinion is how compact it is just watch please look look at the dimension look easy storage for the crib and easy to fit in a suitcase when you're on the go y'all know me i travel a ton so i was like i need something just in case places don't have a steamer because a lot of places will most likely have an iron i can iron but it's not my preference i'd rather just hang it up steam it and be on my way you know so i love that it's compact like this and it 
carries a decent amount of water you can get through a few pieces of clothing before you have to refill it so yeah I really like this steamer I like it a lot I like how compact it is it's very sleek it's very minimalistic from an aesthetic perspective no but um, yeah something that you need for your fashion items your clothing get the steamer while we're on the topic of travel i want to really touch on some things that i've been loving taking on my trips with me that have made my life a whole lot easier with traveling and i'm going to start off with this three-piece luggage set i'm gonna have the clip away here because obviously i'm not gonna carry a whole luggage <laughs> right here on my bed but this luggage moves it glides so smoothly through the airport i don't have to worry about it snagging onto anything not not twisting not rolling around none of that moves like a dream it's almost silent I, i'm pretty sure it's silent moves with no effort the thing that i love the most especially if you are a renter like myself or if you have limited space in your home they can collapse into each other so it's a three piece and they all nest into each other so you basically the smallest one goes into the medium one both of those go into the big one and all you can close the big one and all it is is you storing the big one in a sense so i really love them um i got so much wear out of them yes i brought all three to london and did <laughs> i just had one bag full of shoes like it's the definitely that serious just saying i love it because depending on what your vibe is you can only travel with the medium and just like a, a backpack or you can decide to bring the big one and a small one as your carry-on perfect for any travel any trip that you want to take on you'll be covered when i tell you i know you're gonna be tempted to get that luggage at target get that luggage at tj maxx get that luggage at marshall's i've done it okay and there's no hate, no shade towards that, but this is some of the highest quality luggage that I think I've ever purchased. And I've been traveling for years. So get your hands on it. It's amazing. And I'm pretty sure it came in less than two days. I No, no, it came in a day. I ordered it the night before my London trip. I don't know what I was thinking, but I was like, you know what, let me just chance it. And baby, when I tell you, it came 30 minutes before I was supposed to leave for my trip and I was so happy. I switched all my stuff to that luggage and I was out of there. I'm gone. Big racks down. Get the luggage. <laughs> okay, moving on in the travel category. Packing cubes. I don't even know how I was packing my stuff up before I discovered packing cubes. It's really a tragedy for real. These are the packing cubes that I got recently before I went to London and they saved me so much space. So it says bag ale, but this is the biggest one. I, I believe you can buy different sizes, but this one comes with four, I believe. So comes with that biggest one that you just saw. It comes with two of like, they're different sizes, like length and width, but they're both like equal out to about be the same. But these are two of like the medium size. And then it comes with a small one. And you can see I already still have stuff in here because I'm about to go on a trip literally tomorrow. <laughs> so I might as well keep my stuff in here. I love these, okay? These save me so much space. You can just roll up your underwear, roll up your bras, roll up your socks, whatever, fit them all in here, done. This one can be for all of your tops. This one can be for all of your bottoms. And then the big one can be for like dresses, blazers, and things of that sort. And then you will end up finding out that when you pack up all your stuff like that, you'll have a whole nother extra side for God knows whatever, shoes, bags, you name it. So packing cubes have literally saved my life love them cop them so next is my carry-on duffel bag this is the bag i'm sure you guys have seen this on tiktok a bunch but it looks like this it's giving very much the bays uh i don't know what it's called like a weekender bag or whatever but anyway it looks like this mine's all kind of crumpled up just because it has things still in it because like i just said i'm going on a trip literally tomorrow but yeah, the thing that I like about it is there's so many compartments and it also has a slip right here to go on the top of your uh, carry-on luggage. And then there's a whole open bottom here 
compartment for a pair of shoes or two or three you could put lip you could fit all of your flip-flops and sandals in this bottom compartment it's crazy how much space there is literally if you wanted to if you're really that girl you could use this as a weekender with a carry-on luggage and then you'd be good but it really just depends i'm an overpacker so i can never <laughs> but i'm very envious of the girls that can so yeah love this comes with so many different pockets it's huge on the inside i don't know if you could see the depth <laughs> but uh yeah really like this bag a lot all right two more in the travel sector and we will move on so the next item is this makeup bag it's like a little makeup container and it has a front zipper here if you want to put anything you know important in this front pocket but you open it up and there is quite a bit of space in here and i love that there's uh, a few pockets here um, and the top has a makeup brush compartment very thoughtful very cute um, you can even see the discoloration from my makeup brushes but I really like this one also because of how deep it is you can put your product standing straight up you don't have to worry about them tilting on their side potentially leaking anything like that so yeah I really like this makeup slash product bag it's perfect it fits boom I, I actually put this in either my carry-on bag or that duffel bag that I just showed you um, and I set it right upwards so that nothing spills and every time I get to my destination it's still intact knock on wood <laughs> um, but yeah I really like this last but not least for the travel items we are going to talk about this travel jewelry case um, it's gotten to the point that because I travel so often and because I've been so busy, I have just been keeping my everyday jewelry, uh, pieces that I reach for the most in this. Um, and it looks like so. So as you can see with the reflection, it comes with a little mirror, but it's not just the mirror guys. If you pull it down, there is a place for you to store necklaces of any sort. But the bottom, I just have, I, there's actually another divider that you can remove in here. So this side is for rings, this side is for like different types of earrings. Um, I removed the other side, or the other insert, and I just kind of let all of my stuff be free. And it's very compact, fits a lot of stuff, and it's nice to take on the go with you. You don't have to worry about your necklaces tangling, you losing anything. It all fits nice and concise in this little box okay moving on to home slash decor items i really like this one uh amazon actually has a lot of hidden gems believe it or not the first item it is obviously too big for me to hold <laughs> sitting here on my bed but it is this mirror to the side of me how gorgeous i get so many comments and questions about this mirror y'all i don't know maybe it's the black trim may i don't know if it's the size whatever but it is stunning and for the cost i was like yes immediately swipe my card uh so i got it during a black friday sale i don't know if it's going to still be the same price as of right now um the price may have gone up most likely because obviously demand will increase the price but nonetheless i'm going to leave for you guys it's great it does not warp you know some of those cheap mirrors will warp and make you look kind of funny looking in the mirror um none of that it's very sturdy i just have it mounted to the wall even though i'm leaning it so that i can pull it um, away from the wall and it's still like a chain as attaching it to the wall just in case god forbid of any accidents the mirror is safe i'm safe we're all good so yes the mirror will be linked down below the next item is this tray. Now I know you're probably thinking, girl, we don't care about that tray, but hear me out. <laughs> when I first moved to this apartment, I was just trying to find something very basic, but wide enough to fit multiple things. And I found this black tray. Um, this is actually one of the sizes. It also comes with a larger size. Um, if you have a very grand counter space, but this is perfect for my bathroom. I have like my soap, my lotion, Q-tips, um, cotton pads, etc. 
in this tray perfect just for like bathroom display perfect for like perfume per, uh, display and a bedroom um, very sturdy and the bottom is like felt so it doesn't scratch anything um, but I don't know if you could tell it's very sturdy just a little basic boring tray but it's giving sleek sophisticated home decor at the same time moving right along with the decor pieces this is the infamous Chanel coffee table book all right I'm sure you guys know all about this you've seen it a million times here's what the boning looks like it everybody and their mama got this book but it's a goodie it's a goodie I'm sorry and for the price point you have to snag it you have to snag it if you're into interior design home decor just get this book okay the Tom Ford one is stunning it's thick and it is a arm and a leg for no freaking reason and I stand by that will I still buy it yes absolutely will I be pissed about it yes absolutely <laughs> but if you are looking to get a nice little simple modern coffee table book and not break the bank this Chanel one should be right up your alley two candle accessories and then we will move on to the next section so I'm sure you guys have heard about these seen them everywhere it is just a candle wick trimmer and a candle snuffer so once you light the candle um, you will use this to put the candle out once you are ready instead of blowing it apparently blowing it blows the uh, aroma away or I don't know I don't know I've heard a few different things but nonetheless apparently you're supposed to use this to snuff or put the candles out um, so this comes in a set actually it comes with an, a third item which i cannot find uh basically it's like a uh just a long like stick looking thing that you can use to like dig out particles out of the candle you can use to adjust the wick if it falls to the side i will have the set linked down below for you guys and last but not least this is an oldie but a goodie okay this this girl done been through a few apartments with me <laughs> this is a rechargeable usb candle lighter if you are still going and buying them candle lighters what by that one brand i think it's called like bic or something like that where it has the propane is it propane gasoline whatever and and you have to click and then it lights baby what are you doing just just get you one that's rechargeable it's rechargeable it's never not gonna work it's never gonna go out of out of the, out of the propane it's always gonna work so this one as you see you swipe up and uh, I need to charge mine but all you have to do is hold this button and I don't know if you guys can see that yeah this is great um, you don't have to worry about people accidentally burn themselves lying nothing on fire um, you have to literally get close to ignite something with this okay now moving on to tech this is probably one of the most exciting sectors for me at least being a content creator i like to know what's new what's hot what's working what's not working what do i need to purchase to make the content that i'm giving to y'all better so even though you do not have to be a content creator or any influencer or in that line of work at all i still do think these items are very good and useful for even just the girlies that want to go out do solo activities but capture themselves or you're going out to eat and it's dark if you're catching my drip don't worry baby i got you so the first one is this tripod and before i start hearing anything from the peanut gallery this is a tripod it's a tripod. So, as you see here at the bottom, it says push. So you push and watch. It opens up. Boom. <laughs> yeah. One minute you thought it was a weapon or something nasty. Next minute it's a tripod. And it keeps going. And it keeps going. And it keeps going and it and it baby are y'all seeing this are y'all seeing the length on this bad boy oh god now i'm about to hit my lights <laughs> i love it and the best part for me because even though i do this social media stuff i am very technical technical 
I am very technicality, technically, what is the word? I am very technically challenged. Meaning when it comes to certain things tech wise, I just struggle. Like I, I need it to be as user friendly as possible. So what I love is there is just a simple bar for the phone. It's adjustable. It fits literally any device. You slide it in here like this and boom. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. <laughs> like, you get what I'm saying? It's just, it's easy. It's easy. You don't have to do all the finagling. And if you want to go, you know, that mode, you can do that mode. If you want to go other side, you can go other side. It goes back and forth, complete 180. I love it. I love it. It's very portable too. So if you're somebody like me and you're always on the go, whether it's actual travel or you're just busy, a busy body, look at how easily this collapses down and will fit into your bag. You need her. I know, I know. I just blew your mind. Go ahead and tap that description box, baby. You need this. Okay, we are going to get into the UK Baddie Essential Starter Kit. And what do the UK Baddies have on deck at all times? At all times. They got their light. <laughs> you are never gonna see a UK babe out in public getting her flicks and she don't got this light. Am I lying? The light is a must. The light is gonna, it's gonna serve, it's gonna give the girls clarity. It's gonna give the girls high profile. It's gonna give the girls beat face, melanin sitting, pretty. It's gonna give the girls all that. You need this light. The best part about this light is you can clip it on the top of your phone. Like, what? Good night, good night. I'm outside. This is me, I'm outside, right? I need Ebo and Shayo, Shayo. You're here with me, babes. You're seeing, you're seeing the scene. You're seeing exactly what's going on because I got the light on me, yeah. I mean, you could tell how bright it is just from, it's picking up on camera, like, mm-hmm. It's a must, and that's all I have to say about that. I know we already talked about one light, but I gotta bring up this light too, y'all. This light does not clip onto anything, but it can be screwed onto a tripod. It can be connected to a DSLR camera. And when I turn this drone on, just brace yourself. Brace yourself. Good night. Baby, and this is not even the highest. This is the this is this is low. Like just just watch. I'm I'm finna brighten it for you. Oh my god. It's so bright, it's overpowering my two studio lights in front of me. So I use this one when I am taking photos of my girls or they're taking photos of me. It's a situation like this. So you're holding the light here and you're taking the picture here. So it's giving paparazzi. It's giving paparazzi. It's giving Kim, what'd you have for breakfast? That's what it's giving. It's giving, is it true? Are the rumors true? That's what it's giving. And I love that for me. You need this light. You need both of the lights, but last but not least is this travel charger i actually got this as a secret santa gift from a co-worker and i love her i ran and i'm pretty sure i slammed that in my amazon storefront because this thing comes in clutch now don't judge me i still got the iphone 12 pro max still a pretty good iphone but it's two generations behind so i have the prong that looks like this for the charger but I do believe that they sell ones for the 13 and the 14 as well. But yeah, it comes um, on the side with a charging port. All you have to do, plug into the wall, charge it up. Throw this in your bag, your purse, ladies, especially if you're going out at night. You never know what can happen. Your phone can die. You don't want to be left stranded, looking stupid, scared, confused, all of that. You need a portable charger on the go. This is one of the best ones I think I've ever had because it fits on the bottom of your phone so seamlessly and you can just still go about your business, go about your day. Oh, you heard you heard the connection. And it also holds a charge very well. I think I had put this on when I was in London. I probably was on like 3% 
and the whole charge of this i think took me to about 60 percent or so which is pretty good portable charger you need it ladies this is one of the things i meant to mention and i skipped right over it and it is the studio lights that i used to film as you see when i brought it away from me it went instantly dark and now we're back to evened out nice and bright i don't have a single light on in this room besides that table light and the one right here as well those are very small and they're really just to light the room behind me or give some dimension um i have two of those lights in front of me uh there's a window to the left of me so i have one in, uh, directly in front and one to the side just to kind of balance out my profile a little bit now that the sun's setting i honestly could bring this one to the side i'll show you what it looks like when i do a little bit of a difference but nothing crazy but uh just to show you and by the way these are dimmable um, you can do cool warm and you can go all the way from 1% to 100% these are currently on only like 50% insane I know I'm gonna move this back to over here but yeah so they do the job for me every single time I could film at nighttime if I wanted to I'm just somebody that likes to film during the daytime but if I wanted to these would have me covered so moving along to the beauty category we have three items that I feel like are essentials that we need to talk about ladies the first one being these African net body scrubbers these joints will get your body so smooth go and ask my mama okay <laughs> um yes i am nigerian i'm very familiar with these these are great the thing that's also so nice about these is not only what they do but the fact that because of how it's structured it is very rare that the bacteria is going to linger and hang on to these like it will on like a wash rag a loofah etc okay so you could see it's very thin <laughs> extremely thin um and very porous there's a lot of holes so yeah you just get in there mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. this will get rid of all of your back knee um even out your skin tone make your skin less rough this is that good stuff two more items in the beauty category this is a tried and true this is how the face is sitting today and they are these beauty puffs if you are not using a powder puff to set your under eyes babe what are you doing no no seriously like comment down below what do you use am i did i miss the memo because these are gas these are amazing okay this particular one came in a 10 pack and baby i reused them i've been using the one that i use today for quite a bit of time i probably should throw that one out but anyway that's neither here nor there they're great they last a very long time they make your makeup application just buttery smooth chef's kiss you need them i told you first last but not least in the beauty category is this fan <laughs> when i tell you she does not let me down she has a low setting and a high setting i mainly use her um to when i get out of the shower when i just wash my face whatever to dry my lashes down you know with my spoolie but i also will pack her especially in this hot humid houston texas weather i will pack her when i'm going out at night when i'm going out you know for brunch whatever when i know it's gonna be hot i potentially am gonna be bumming into people it's it's a function chatman and kirby if you know you know fan me down fan me down i mean do you see the speed on that john look at the hair it's giving beyonce with the bob <laughs> anyway i'm like her like i said i'm like everything i don't even know why i keep saying that you need this fan she goes she's thin she goes in a bag real easy keep yourself calm cool and collected this summer baby don't get caught slipping okay the last section is health okay i have really been focusing on my gut health my skin health my hair health my overall internal body health and 
one thing that has been getting me there were well, really two things but revolved around one thing is my vitamins this brand NutraCost if you are familiar with anything on TikTok as of the last year or two then you know all about L-glutamine but what I did not know was that L-glutamine came in capsules I thought that it was only powder found out about the capsules the capsules changed my life I would rather just pop a quick pill and go then have to pour it into something dissolve it I already take the greens I already take the protein I like I don't need any more powders <laughs> give me the pills okay so these are just two I also have my B complex my biotin and something else I can't think off the top of my head but this is the L glutamine and the magnesium oxide if you like I said have been anywhere on TikTok then you know this is the the holy mecca of a flat tummy and good sleep and what's even helping me more in addition to my vitamins is my pill container i could take them on the go with me at all times i don't have to worry about oh shoot i'm running late i didn't get to take my pills no baby you got them okay and i like the case it's cute it's neutral <laughs> i'm just a neutral girly but it's small it's compact it fits in your purse you know your work bag your gym bag carry on anything so these two things have really been changing the game for my health my gut health my my mind body spirit all that <laughs> no but for real you need you both of these okay hot girl summer we need a flat tummy now this may be a little bit of a inappropriate sensitive subject i don't do all that okay we are all ladies here we all know about the nasty rotten situation when it comes to bb yeast all that okay so one thing that has changed my life years ago and i put everybody that i can onto it is boric acid suppositories now you are not supposed to pop a boric acid suppository every single day ladies you are not you are only supposed to pop one when you feel a little bit out of whack you feel like your ph is off a little bit if you know that you know you should know because you do now okay <laughs> things that i came across so you don't have to use your finger to put that suppository in are these suppository applicators so they look like this and they look like so i'm not gonna unwrap it but i do love that they all come individually wrapped for sanitary purposes but you unwrap it and you see this little area is where the pill will go in this plunge pulls out and then you're able to push it up into your vagina and go to bed so yeah boric acid suppository applicators have been a game changer for me whenever i need to use boric acid um, I just grabbed one of these. It comes with a pack of 20. So this pack has lasted me months, okay? Because obviously I don't need this every day, not even every week, you know? Just every once in a while when you feel, you know, maybe it's like the last day of the period. You just got off your period, whatever it is. Grab you one of these with a boric acid pill and you will be good to go. All right, that brings me to the end of this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed. I genuinely love filming haul videos, sit down videos for you guys. Gives you guys a little bit something different than just the hours and hours and hours of me running my mouth in my vlogs. Um, so if you did like this video, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Comment down below what were your favorite items or any of the items that you can't wait to pick up yourself. Also, if you are new here and you have not joined the gang already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Matter of fact, run and smash it. Smash that subscribe button, okay? We are almost at 10K. Oh my God, it got us so good. I cannot believe it. That's so crazy. Such a important milestone i've really only been taking this seriously for a few months and just to see the growth is insane i'm so grateful for y'all red gang so yeah if you are new here please do not hesitate to join the gang we are a big family over here and we would love to have you without further ado red gang i will see you in the next one bye